am Bonnie Saratori with Spiritual Acceleration, and this is the February update for the month of February, which actually is a cool one, and the topic is light and fun. So this will be a, a good month for all of us. And I just want to remind everyone that we do have two very, very potent, powerful clearings, group clearings coming up. This month, so February 9th, we have I Am Worthy of Love, okay? So you want to get in there and get that clearing because it's going to open you up so that you know you are worthy of love, okay? doesn't matter if you're already in a relationship or not. Everyone is actually worthy of love, but we want to know it. We want to live it. And then on the 23rd, um, Becoming Magnetic, um, Connecting with Your inner charm okay that'll be a fun one as well so these are the february group clearings you want to get those and um, at the end of this i'm gonna do some activations okay but coming back to our topic february is light and fun so you know everyone knows we've been going through lots of deep unraveling clearings healings waking up all kinds of cool stuff so this month in february let's just take advantage of this one because the frequency really is a high vibrational frequency. It has a lot of beautiful light happening on the planet. And it has um, almost like a, there is a little bit of a, like a sparkly kind of energy frequency presenting in February. What it does is it allow, you know, it has this quality or feeling of, you know, happy, up, upbeat, you know, so we're experiencing more joy, more happiness, you know, the, the energy frequency has so much more light and it allows for us just to have fun. You know, we've been in the midst of all these intense times and all the horrors of earth changes. It, all of these are still happening, but there's still a frequency right now for the month of February where the, the frequency of the new paradigm is shining all this beautiful light. And right in this particular month, it's not so much about bringing up your subconscious. It's kind of like a, a little bit of a reprieve. You know, a little breathing room to, you've been doing lots of inner work and facing oneself. And, and now it's like, it's like a reward, so to speak. You know, it's like, all right, we're going to have some fun. We're going to have some light. Let's just really let the heart open and let ourselves express, you know, all this joy that we really do have. Because remember, in the very core of all of us is unconditional love and light. So this month, the more we just keep opening and just saying yes to just laughter and fun and just knowing that there's a lightness happening this month, that we can actually take advantage of that, that we can actually feel and sense that. And the more that we allow ourselves to experience that frequency of light and fun, the more our heart opens. Okay, so it kind of goes both ways. You know, we digging in the dirt, getting into our deep unconscious, unraveling these deep places that have been affecting us and and um, keeping us stuck and keeping us from sharing the gift of who we are and keeping us like victims and poor me's. You know, it's like all this energy is just lifting, lifting. And I can see even more light in people's like uh, the subconscious. It's like this light is shining. But what it's shining on now is who we really are, which is that frequency in the core, the eternal us, the untouchable us, the unbroken us, the pure essence and pure energy of us is pure love and light. So that is what's getting awakened in this month, which is really awesome. It's beautiful. It's wonderful. Okay. Now, it doesn't mean that some people will still be in their, you know, their pain and suffering. Okay. It's because of what's really happening is those of us that are really riding the energy, the frequencies that are presenting that are helping us, uh, you know, the energy frequencies, the, the, the stars, the planets, things lining up, the energy frequencies of the new paradigm, the new world, new earth, all of these energies are affecting uh, all of us. But the difference is, is those who are truly on a, a path of awakening to end their suffering, to at least, you know, make changes and help to heal some of the, those really broken places within, these are the peoples who are going to truly feel the effects of these energy frequencies that are, you know, shining on the planet. And again, you know, there's still going to be other peoples. And because what happens is 
when we want to hold on to our suffering, and this is, unfortunately, this is true for most everyone. Okay, we have a perverse pleasure in our suffering. We want to hold on to it. Who will we be without it? Okay, we have these beliefs, strong beliefs. And these strong beliefs get in the way and we believe them. Okay, so I remember in my life when I was attached to my own suffering, you know, I, it was like, I hurt so bad, you know, it's like I hurt worse than anybody. I'm in greater suffering than anybody, you know, it's like we all have that. And when we start unraveling that and waking up to it, you know, waking up to that perverse pleasure and own suffering, we start to make changes, okay? Unfortunately, most of humanity isn't even on that journey, okay? They're still in, poor me, I'm suffering, you're making it happen, you're the reason why, everything out there is the, is the fault, is the world, is the people's, people aren't looking to the self, okay? So those of you who are looking within, which you are, otherwise you wouldn't be here, you're willing to face yourself, you're willing to you dig in the dirt, so to speak, and you're willing to heal your woundings so that you can be more free, more liberated. Pretty simple. <laughs> Those are the ones who are going to be feeling and experiencing the, the light and fun energy that's actually hitting planet Earth in February. Okay? It's really, I'm telling you, it's really cool. It's just like, it's like this light. There's like this light frequency. I literally see like little sparkles, sparkly, sparkle energy frequencies, and I see and feel and sense that that energy of light, but also fun. There's something about those little sparkly things in that energy frequency in February where it does have that quality of fun. Okay. So I'm just going to encourage you on your in your life, take it whenever there's even just a little inkling of laughter, laugh. Okay. There's a little inkling of having fun. Just open it and say yes to it and move into it. Okay. And it does make a difference. It really does. Okay. It's just like I'm feeling, okay, I can feel like, oh, yeah, things are a little lighter. And rather than going into your mind thoughts of wondering, oh, when's the other shoe going to drop or when's the rug going to get pulled out or when is this all come to an end? Oh, I don't want to, I don't let myself have fun. I don't want to let myself open and, and experience light and fun because, you know, something else is going to happen. Okay. But here's the thing when you open, and just laugh and have fun. Something also shifts in your subconscious, for real, okay? I've actually been having that experience these last couple of weeks, you know, like facing different things that are in my awareness and, and then just so much laughter, like, like serious laughter, you know, cracking up, you know? And there's something that happens. I can actually physically feel some of these other places, holding places, belief systems, contractions they just kind of like loosen up and things let go and then energy moves more easily up and out of the body which is what we want so february you know this is also the month where that we we celebrate um valentine's for most for many people especially in the states we uh, maybe other places have it as well but for us we have valentine's which is a time of love you know partnership love relationship intimacy being connected with another human, you know, just sharing the gift of you and sharing the, the experience of one another. So in that, that it's like, this is also a great month for us to have that light and fun energy, because, you know, when you're with your, your, your beloved, your loved one, you know, there's, there's a lot of you know, things you're dealing with, things you're getting challenged with, things you're getting triggered by. And by just letting everything go, and just experiencing that energy of just pure light and fun, you know, you're going to take your relationship to a whole new level, deeper and deeper, okay? And what's cool too is when you are in a state where you're feeling that light, you're willing to be more authentic. You're willing to be more vulnerable. You're willing to share more of you because it just feels safer, okay? So again, I just really want to encourage people to, that that's, uh, uh, this is an opportunity and, and you can be shifting lots of different things and opening your heart up even more to knowing love, unconditional love. And even for those who are not in any kind of relationship, for those also that are like longing for connection, because that's what happens for people. Many people are longing to have a connection if you're not believing that that's going to save you, that's going to change your world, that's going to make you happy, okay? <laughs> 
<laughs> so again, you don't have to be in relationship. You don't have to be celebrating Valentine's Day with someone else. You can still have laughter. You can still have light and fun in your life. Okay. You, if you've got friends or family or people you enjoy, have a blast. Just say yes. Say yes and laugh all you can. Now, there are some people who are completely isolated in a sense and they don't have anyone. But again, you guys, <laughs> I crack up all the time. You know, I might see something or hear something and, you know, watch or witness something and I just crack up. Okay. So there's a, that opportunity to just experience that frequency of fun, light, and fun. Okay. So think about that. Just be open to that. Have that in your awareness. So when you, you know, something's happening and you feel yourself just kind of cracking up or laughing or just having fun, you're gonna, probably going to also notice that little part in there that goes, mm, hold back, mm, don't, don't, don't let go, don't, don't really have a lot of fun, okay? Whatever you do, don't give yourself that, okay? Just when you feel that, sense that, just say, mm-mm, this is the time, I'm going to just crack up, I'm going to laugh, I'm just going to have fun, bring in light to my life, because it's going to shift you from within, Okay? It's kind of like doing your inner work when you come in and you face these really dark places. You face these places where you got hurt, where there's all this wounding, heartbroken, you know, all that intense energy that lives in the, in the subconscious of all of humanity. You know, when we are facing these places, we're unraveling, but there's a balance. And that balance does mean, let's just laugh about it. Let's just see the big cosmic joke of everything and just crack up because you'll be in it again someday down the road. Okay, we know that. All right. But in the meantime, let's just have a blast. Let's just have light and fun in our life. OK, so I want to do a couple of activations here and to help you have fun. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to come in and look at some of the areas where you're um, blocking it, stopping it, interferences. I want to move a little bit of energy and then we'll get that activation happening. OK. So when, I, when I'm just tracking, looking in, I can definitely see, energy, you know, it's like beliefs and conclusions and evidence and proof, you know, that life is painful, life is suffering, life hurts, okay? But I'm going to just start releasing some of those energies within because it's not the truth. It's not the absolute, okay? So now as I come into your subconscious, and I'm going to start releasing and lifting a heaviness. It's like a it's like a heaviness. It's like a, a down, downer, kind of like, uh, you know, suppressing energies and feeling down, bad, whatever. So let me just start lifting those energy frequencies. Lifting, lifting, lifting. I'm going to bring in the white flame to start dissolving. Because here's the thing. These emotions are not the absolute. They're not who you are, okay? They're carryover. They're reinforced by energy frequencies of this lifetime. But it is not the truth of who you are. You are pure love and light in the core of your being. So now we just want to get what the debris, the debris, the evidence, the conclusions and beliefs, all of that, that you anchored in by your own misperceptions of reality, conclusions, releasing some of that energy, giving more relief so that we can open to more fun, light, light, light and fun. All right, here we go. More, more, more. Shatter, 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 shatter. Shatter, shatter, shatter. And I'm going to go deep into the core. Ooh, yep. I'm going to go right into that well of grief. Whoa, right there. Right in there. I'm going to be shatter, shatter, shatter. White flame, white flame, white flame coming in. Coming in. Dissolving. There we go. Light it up. White flame, strong, potent, powerful. Holy Spirit itself coming in. Light, 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 light. Dissolve. Shatter, 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 shatter. Shatter, shatter, shatter. There we go. Releasing, releasing, releasing. Clearing, clear, 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 clear. Good. There we go. Get the energy moving. Now, I'm going to activate your ability to experience and know the frequency of light and fun. So I'm just coming right in. Mm -hmm. I'm going to come right in, right at the seat of the soul. Mm -hmm. And those parts of you that are anchored in the light, pure light energy, light and fun. And I'm going to experience expand that, waken that up, waken it up, all right, to there, right in there, coming right in, right in there, mm-hmm, mm-hmm, okay, good, 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 right there, activating, activating, activate, 
right there, right there, right there, right there, a little bit more right there, right there. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Energy moving. Beautiful. Good. All right. Let's just see how that all ends up playing out. And again, just a reminder, upcoming uh, group clearings coming up on the 9th. I am worthy of love. And on the 23rd, <laughs> becoming magnetic, connecting with inner charm. And I'm excited to share with you that we are offering for Valentine's uh, packages to help you with your relationship in love. Okay, this is for a short period only. And it's a many, many clearings that are going to help activate you, help you really open your heart to love. You don't want to miss out on this package deal.